The government has uh, backpedaled on, on the issue of conversion therapy. They were going to ban it. They were going to, and then now they've said that they're going to continue to ban it, um, but drop the element um, when it comes to tr gender identity. And just for viewers, um, they were going to include a law that um, meant that there was you were not essentially allowed to counsel people um, on the gender that they were effectively born in, and they've dropped that element on the conversion therapy. I mean, what, what, what's your reaction to that? I mean, it's been welcomed by some, criticised by others. <clears throat> well, the, there is a, there's no comparison really to be made between the concept of uh, sexual orientation, which is how you're wired to, to, to be sexually attracted to um, a particular sex, and this, this whole idea of gender identity, I mean, you know, we can't even define gender, so how can we talk about gender identity? And when you, you see people describing, when they talk about gender identity, you, you listen to them and it's all about stereotypes. And you, you find that they, if you try and take them out of that conversation, it's like, well, define this without resorting to stereotypes or subjective feeling. Give me something material or empirical to work with. And it's, it's just all about feeling. There's absolutely nothing behind it. The conversion therapy, the I would say that um, conversion therapy against um, for homosexuality to try to turn um, gay people and lesbians straight is rather more prevalent than you would think. Um, it's it's not as a lot of people have said. It's it's not just restricted to small um, small churches of particular demographics. It's actually it, there's actually more of it around than you than you might think. And I, I think it is very very damaging. Um, th this whole idea of this being comparable to ideas of gender identity, what you find is with with, with people is this, this subjective feeling of feeling like a yeah. woman is something that, yeah. so, that so progresses Amanda, over quite a long period of time. You. So it's not we're not yeah. comparing the right one thing with the right thing. Mm -hmm. So I'm yeah. glad the government is saying it's not applying to trans because it's just a move to get rid of gatekeeping.